My name is Jeremy Kemp. I work with San Jose State School of Library and Information Science. This is a very quick tutorial using the Canon T2i uh, to do a green screen setup. So I've done a couple of things here. One, you can see the microphone. Uh, I had to synchronize these because the T2 one doesn't flow directly into Camtasia. Also, I used Camtasia um, from TechSmith in order to grab the video in and edit it. I had to flip the uh, camera video upside down. You can see that uh, it's hanging off of my desk right now, uh, upside down. So another thing I did was bring the whole project into um, Adobe After Effects in order to add this green screen, which you see right here behind me. The lighting here is pretty interesting. I've got um, a halogen, a really bright halogen, 500 watt on this side. Then I've got uh, up here uh, behind me, um, uh, an incandescent, well actually that's also a halogen uh, coming off. Then I have the green screen itself which is lit sideways but with a halogen and actually I forgot one more light. Turn this one on here to give myself um, a good um, frontal uh, lighting. So I've got lighting on this side, lighting back behind me giving me a nice um, sort of halo effect that I can cut out in, in uh, Adobe After Effects. I'm lit in front and then uh, the camera you can see is upside down, so I had to reflip it. This is a very nice, uh, the blue uh, micro microphone, uh, it's a THX certified. So in order to sync up both the audio and the video, I had to use um, some video and audio tricks like this clap. So then I can get the audio and video synced up. This is a whole lot of work going on here. Uh, this little short clip I figure is probably going to take me about an hour to process and put up on YouTube. But it's high def, um, good sound, good lighting, and with a backdrop uh, here at San Jose State. So enjoy!